Minneapolis police investigating a deadly shooting that unfolded in the middle of the morning. A woman is dead, a suspect vehicle seen fleeing the area. Our Paul Bloom is downtown for us tonight with the latest on the investigation and, and a message, Paul, from MPD tonight. Absolutely, Randy, with this shooting seemingly a targeted offense or attack, the message from MPD quite clear and simple as temperatures rise, put the guns down. At least based off preliminary information, Minneapolis police believe the shooting just before 10 a.m. broad daylight was not random. Apparently targeted gunfire aimed at this RV parked along the 1300 block of Gerard Avenue North just off Plymouth Ave. Two people inside at the time, a man and woman. The woman described as in her 40s was reportedly struck in the neck and died at the scene. It occurred in the middle of a neighborhood in the middle of a morning. And for anybody who's heard or saw what occurred this morning, it's extremely concerning. And to that point, the male who apparently survived the shooting without injury became agitated in the immediate aftermath, eventually subdued by police and taken to a hospital by ambulance. People process things very differently. Some get quiet, some become very vocal. Um, and that, I think, might be what we are seeing today is uh, somebody experiencing grief and, and uh, uh, expressing that grief. Minneapolis Police Public Information Officer Garrett Parton reported that a passenger vehicle was seen fleeing the area after the gunfire. No speculation on the motive at this point. MPD reports the woman's death is the 42nd homicide in the state's largest city already this year. At last check with MPD at headquarters behind me here at City Hall, they had yet to make any arrests, really asking for the community's assistance for any tips or leads. Live in downtown, Paul Bloom, Fox 9.